Hello, I'm Dr. Wei Hu. Currently is Clinical Movement Disorder Fellow at the Neurology Department of University of Florida. I was a Deep Brain Stimulation Fellow at Neurology Department at Mayo Clinic. The title of my publication is Long-Term Outcome of Globus Pallidus Internus, Deep Brain Stimulation in Patients with Torres Syndrome. This article will appear in an upcoming issue of Mayo Clinic Proceedings. As you know, Tourette's syndrome is a chronic neurodevelopment disorder characterized by mold and phonic tics that by definition occur with a childhood onset. Some patients have disabling tics in severely affected medication and behavioral therapy resistant Tourette's syndrome. This study is conducted by neurosurgeon at Beijing Tiantan Hospital, China, and a neurologist at Mayo Clinic. Neurosurgery Center of Beijing Tiantan Hospital is one of the largest neurosurgical base in the world. As directed by Professor Zhang and Professor Men, DBS Center at Tiantan Hospital is the largest and best center in China and performed almost 300 DBS procedures per year. Our study is to evaluate the effectiveness of deep brain stimulation of the globus pallidus internus, GPI, on tick severity and common comorbidities in patients with severe Tourette syndrome that is refractory to pharmacological treatment and psychotherapy. We retrospectively assess the long-term clinical outcomes of certain patients with treatment to refractory Tourette syndrome who underwent deep brain stimulation targeting the GPI from January 2006 to May 2013. The primary outcome was a change in tick severity as measured by the Yale Global Tick Severity Scale. And the secondary outcome was a change in associated behavior disorder and mood as measured by the Tourette Syndrome Quality of Life Scale Assessment. Our results suggested that Compared with baseline, the mean reduction in the total year global tick severity score at last follow-up was 52%. A peer sample t-test revealed a significant improvement of tick symptoms after six months of DBS programming. The Tourette syndrome quality of life scale score improved by a mean of 46%. This study is currently the largest reported GPI DBS case series of patients with treatment refractory Tourette syndrome with the longest follow up. Our results support the potential beneficial effect of GPI DBS on disabling tick reduction and improvement of quality of life. This study is also participating in international deep brain stimulation Tourette syndrome database organized by Professor Michael Okun, who is the Director of Movement Disorder Center at the University of Florida. In the near future, deep brain may improve disabling tics in severely affected medication and the behavior resistant to Tourette syndrome. We hope you found this presentation from the content of Mayo Clinic Proceedings valuable. Our journal's mission is to promote the best interests of patients by advancing the knowledge and professionalism of the physician community. If you are interested in more information about us, our home page is www.mayoclinicproceedings.org. There you will find access information for our social media content, such as additional videos on our YouTube channel or journal updates on Facebook. You can also follow us on Twitter. More information about healthcare at Mayo Clinic is available at www.mayoclinic.com. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.